September 20th, 10 days left. Lyrical exercise, 100, 10 times, 10 straight reps. I spoke to the sister today and she suggested I record passionate conversations on the record with women of color sharing insights of my reflective, intelligent, modern male melanated perspective. She say, you ain't, I mean, nobody is perfect, but I know you won't cause intentional pollution because you speak kind of candid with the truth and I always talk about giving some solutions. She say, I can help redefine the social standard and character of brothers dating sisters living in America. So I'm up for the challenge. She told me in depth without malice how she ended relations with this brother who lied about being married and was taking her out and basically dissing his wife, faking her out and morning, noon and night, displaying and using talent. She say he was presently sexing me one number less than 70, a.k.a. a naked distribution of balance. 69 cancer sign seeming still. But why did he lie? Why couldn't he keep it real? Then that made me reflect on my past dishonesty, even ills. Now, I don't know that brother from Adam. No direct relation to Kenner having him as a family member, but I'm sure we're connected through descendants somewhere. But I relate because of his gender and similar demographics. So instead of dismissing actions committed in different passions, I thought about how we were alike. Like, what was my problem giving the truth and delivering women it too? It shows integrity morally. And you could wake up to a broken car or face or a face of hot grits historically, all from neglect and loyalty. But even if not fully committed or courting the woman, tell her the truth. Don't tell her no story. She can handle honesty better more than the changing of weather quarterly. She might be acting out, cry tears and spill them orderly. But if she can have children, she can surely receive the ugly truth that you tell her hella royally. But she still may have a cow metaphorically. But you can't control that. Only your actions and what you said from the beginning. I didn't like the reaction to telling the truth to those women. So I kept left out, elude and omitted. Instead, I should have changed the fact that I did it, prevent it. And I hated how seeing them cry gave me that feeling. But when someone says you hurt them, you don't get to decide that you didn't. Man, I'm going to table this topic and end it, fam. These are 30 verses in September. And not doing this to get some fans, but if I do, follow me at Real Talk Raps on Instagram.